This is what me and my mom eat in a day as a mom and daughter who have lost 250 pounds combined and recovered from a binge eating disorder. Tulsi helps you to lose weight by regulating your blood sugar. And here I'm putting stevia in my tea because I like sweeter tea. And so if you're using aspartame or sucralose, I highly recommend stevia as a step up. We also drink tea, a lot of tea to suppress our hunger. Mm, and also to heal our bodies. Another one of our favorites is taking liposomal vitamin C and magnesium. This is so, so good tasty. for you. To give you guys an idea of what we mean by eating lots of fiber, we have some roasted broccoli in the oven. We have two poblano peppers on the grill. I actually need to turn them. This is like an old school way, apparently. Oops. And mom is grilling mushrooms. So there's lots of fiber here. And she's doing some veggie chopping. Looks delicious. We love to make our colossal salad and they keep getting more and more elaborate. We put a variety of microgreens and different types of lettuce and we put jicama and carrots and cabbage and it just goes on and on and on. Pretty much anything and everything we feel inspired about, we put into our salad to give us that variety of fiber and phytonutrients. Now I'm in somebody else's fridge. My mom's fridge, my favorite fridge to be honest. So I'm drinking more tea. This is probably my second or third cup. I drink a lot of tea, especially this one because it's super special. I love using these stevia drops. Those have been crucial in my weight loss journey. So here's lunch. We have a pumpernickel bread with a white bean dip, which we didn't show you how to make. And <laughs> you can go check our Instagram to find out how to make it. And lots of nutritional yeast on our colossal salad. <laughs> it looks so good. Look at all those colors. Amazing. So good. No matter what happens in the world, it's super, super important that we always prioritize our health. Even if things are scary or they feel like terrifying, we still have to work out. We still have to get up at the same time every day and prioritize our families and eating whole foods yeah. and eating vegetables and we can't just like give up on our lives because it looks like the world is going to collapse.